Hey everyone and welcome back to the Ride Share Hub. My name is Dylan and in today's video I'm going to talk about my experience being a Lyft driver as a college student. And I'm going to talk about why I think being a Lyft driver is one of the best jobs, if not the best job, for a college student. So before I get into the video, if you're interested in being a Lyft driver, you want to get a sign on bonus, go ahead and use my link in the description. So I'm here on my college campus today, you know I thought it would be fitting for this video. There's our little tower. But yeah, so the first reason why I think driving for Lyft is one of the best ways to make money as a college student is because as a college student, we don't have any. We don't have any money. College costs so much money. There's so many costs like tuition, uh, your rent, your food, you know, going out, your textbooks. There's so much. And for driving for Lyft, you know, it can really help a out a lot with expenses. You can pay for your school, um, you know. You don't, I talk a lot about cash flowing and you don't need to necessarily go into debt uh, in college. You can, you can pay for it um, in cash and you can pay for it while driving for Lyft. So that's one of the, the first reason why I think driving for Lyft is one of the best ways to make money in college. All right, so the second reason is scheduling. All right, as a college student, my schedule changes so much. You know, on Monday, you know, I'm free in the evening. On Tuesday, I'm free in the morning. Wednesday, I have like two hours off. You know, our teachers give out assignments like every single day of the week at a different time. And you know, sometimes there's an event here, like a networking event here, you're like a party here. You know, as a Lyft driver, you can literally sign on and off whenever you want. You don't have to worry about having to clock in at 6 a.m. or you know, 8 a.m. or whatever, working a nine to five. You know, you can work at night if you want. And you know, right now, my sleep schedule is so off. Last night I went to bed at 5 a.m. Like, what am I doing with my life? Uh, but as a Lyft driver, you know, it works out because I didn't need to wake up at 8 a.m. To, to clock into work, you know, I, I can just work later. So as a Lyft driver, you know, and college student, scheduling works out perfectly. Okay, the third reason, number three, numero tres, numero trois, if you speak French. You get to practice your communication skills. As a college student, we're all here to learn. And you know, as a Lyft driver, you're gonna be talking to people, getting people to like you, and it's just a great way to develop your communication skills, even your leadership skills. There's a really good book called How to Win Friends and Influence People. It's by Dale Carnegie. All right, this video is not sponsored by that book at all. You know, the guy's not even alive anymore, so that wouldn't even be possible. Um, but it was literally the first book ever written on communication, and it's the best book ever. He talks about basically how to get people to like you. And so I think that's a great book and it's helped me make so much more money in tips and it's also, um, you know, just helped me in life. You know, when you're meeting tons of people every single day, you you know, you, you're getting to, to know them literally for like 10, 15 minutes, sometimes more if you're if your trip is longer. But you know, and then and then you leave and you never see them again. So it's a good way to practice how to get somebody to like you in a really short amount of time, which is such a good skill to have in life. All right, number four, this is my favorite one. Driving for Lyft is stress-free. As a college student, we have so much stress. You know, that's why I have pimples every other day. You know, I, it's like literally I can't, I can't talk about stress enough in school. You know, if, you, if you've been to college, you know, you know school is stressful. You have papers due at midnight. You have a project due the next day. You have lecture to wake up to. You're going on a date. Like there's so many things that factor into your stress life in college and you shouldn't be stressed on top of that. So driving for Lyft is super stress-free. You don't have to report to a boss or anything. You can clock in, you can clock out. You don't have to report any of your, you know, sales or anything. And you can make as, as much as you want. If you want to make $2,000 a week, you can. You know, you don't have to stop working at any uh, certain amount of time. Uh, actually, you do. It's like 12 hours or something. <laughs> but uh, basically what I'm trying to say is, you know, you don't have to report to a boss. You're work running your own business. Which leads me into number five. This is the last one. Is you working on your business skills. You know, in college you're learning and you're learning how to run your own business. It's, it's really a great way, you know, you're doing your own finances, you're doing your own taxes, and you're learning how to make money on your own. You know, as a college student, that's something that I really value. It's almost like taking a whole nother class or, you know, a whole nother course. You know, you're learning tons of uh, just finance skills, being a Lyft driver, making your own money. All right, guys, so that's it for today's video. Um, if you're interested in being a Lyft driver, go ahead and use my link in the description. You can start making 20 to $30 an hour, even more, you know, if you, if you watch my videos, 
and follow my follow my steps you know check out some of my other videos I, I talk a lot about you know how to make more money how to make more tips I have a video called 40 secrets most lift drivers don't know you know there, there's a bunch of videos on there so go ahead and check them out um, you know join our Facebook group follow us on Instagram um, reach out if you have any questions let me know are you a college student are you interested in driving and I just want to say you know you do have to be 21 years of age in order to be a Lyft driver so if you know if you're almost 21 if you're thinking about it um, you know then you can start driving once you hit 21 you know it's a, that's a great way to celebrate your 21 your 21st birthday is become a Lyft driver um, or if you're you know an older college student if you're going back to college uh, it's a great way to make money on the side or even a full-time income so again hit subscribe at a thousand subscribers we're giving away a couple dash cams and a couple t-shirts you know this is one of the first videos i'm not wearing the rideshare hub t-shirt i'm sure you've seen the t-shirt all right guys thanks so much for watching we'll see you guys next time it's been another episode of the rideshare hub bye